start, Ryan. Uh, win one is in the bag, and now looking towards Vancouver tomorrow. Uh, what are you expecting from the Canucks? Well, obviously their first game, so they're going to come out and have some energy. And um, I think judging by their preseason, they uh, are playing a pretty tight style of game. I think against us, it was pretty, uh, obviously a lot of special teams in the preseason, but it was a pretty tight checking game. So I think for us, we've got to use our speed, check with our legs. And uh, if we do a lot of the things we did last game, we'll be fine. You mentioned the penalties in the preseason. Uh, were you at least a little bit surprised by the, uh, the low amount of calls last game? I just thought we had the puck a lot of the game. I thought we checked with our legs, like I said, and we skated. And uh, when we do that, we're going to obviously limit our penalties. And um, Obviously, every referee is going to call the game differently. I think they have a good feel for the game. and um, I don't think it's going to be quite the same standard as the preseason, but we obviously got to be careful of it. And uh, We've been working on our power play and penalty kill lots, too, so we're ready to go. And um, you know, Those are uh, valuable minutes that uh, can win or lose you a game. Kyler was kind of eased into the game um, against Calgary. Do you foresee him getting some more minutes and, and getting some more playing time uh, against the Canucks? Yeah, I mean, it's your first game. I mean, you got to take things step by step. I mean, uh, I've obviously been through it. Everyone in this room has been through it. And um, you're not going to get everything right away. Obviously, you got to kind of just take baby steps. And um, the preseason is a lot different than the regular season, though. I mean, it's a different game. you got full NHL teams and, you know, guys that are, uh, you know, so you get paid to do come in the regular season and play. So it's obviously a lot tougher. So, you know, he did good. He's a skilled guy. He knows how to play the game. He thinks the game at a high level. And um, he's just got to keep growing and learning. And you know, he's a good, in a good environment to do so. And four hat tricks and four season debuts this season. Uh, and it's a centennial year. Or, um, what do you make of just that history and Connor being a part of it? Yeah, I know. It's uh, four guys. I haven't got a hat trick in my career yet, so I'm still waiting. But. Um, yeah, no, it's pretty pretty crazy. I mean, I watched some games last night, and um, it's funny. You don't see too many hat tricks, especially on opening night. So I guess guys are ready to go and had good summers and work on their shot and stuff like that. So, um, you know, obviously Connor's a special player, and um, I'm sure it's not the only hat trick he's going to get this year.